you know what, first days are uh, typically don't go uh, as fast as you want them because you're doing a lot of teaching. They're trying to catch on to the drills and, and what you're doing for the newcomers. And so we have about half of our team that's new. So there's a lot of teaching going on right now. But the one thing I do see is that we're really athletic. And, and so I really like that because we like to play an up-style, up-tempo style of basketball. Um, the first day of practice was kind of rusty being that everyone, well not everyone, but a lot of people were new to drills. We went hard, we just didn't quite get the whole concept of things. So overall, I think pr practice was pretty good. Um, I see a big jump from last year, even though we lost two key players. I think we have enough people to fill in where we need to. I think that we did good for a first day of practice. I like, as everyone said, we have a lot of kinks to work out, but as for a first day, I think we showed a lot of potential for the season. Some of the drills were like slightly intimidating, like, because you have to push so hard and, like, especially you go with the guards a lot who are a lot faster. But, like, it feels good to be able to keep up with it and it feels good to, like, actually be doing, like, the college drills and participating in them. Um, you know what, Allie Rohde, uh, as a freshman big, you know, she's a big girl, a lefty. I feel really good about her. She's been working so, so hard at practice. Uh, so, so hard in the weight room, and I think she's going to really uh, surprise a lot of people this year. Um, also, we have Chasey Poston, who's a uh, post player, really raw uh, in terms of basketball ability, but athletically, she can do some things that you just can't teach. And so, with us being a transition team, she is going to fit right into what we do. Um, Shailene Harper, she's going to provide some physicalness, some toughness, uh, some grit, some boxing out. Uh, we needed some people to get in there and bang, and so she's definitely going to provide that for us. Leona White is an uh, uh, exceptionally athletic guard on the perimeter. Uh, really can run out in transition, run the lane, can knock down a three-point shot, can knock down a 15-foot point shot. So we're looking for her to do some really good things. Aaron Butler, uh, Lindsey Faring are, can provide outside shooting, so we feel really good about their contributions as well. Um, well, I feel just based off this first practice, they caught on really fast. I know I need to pull them to the side and say, hey, do you understand or do you need any help with anything? But for the most part, I think they adapted pretty quick, and I know that since I'm one of the veterans and I've been here pretty much the longest out of everybody, I know that my job to help lead the team besides the coaches is really strong this year. Um, well, we have, you know, obviously Davlin White coming back and uh, she's going to be, be tremendous for us, you know, from a standpoint of point production. Uh, we're looking for her to be more of a vocal leader, but Shanita Arnold is coming back, Candace Worthen is coming back, Erica Barnes is going to be, I, I think, really key for us down, side, down low. She's going to provide some stability uh, in that area because we're young everywhere else in that post position. So we feel really good about that. Rayco Thomas is, is really going to help us out there on the floor too as well. So um, we're just ready to get into more days of practice. I feel a lot better probably after day four or five. Um, our schedule I think looks pretty good and we have a lot of winnable games. So we just need to stay focused and take one game at a time. No, I'm just ready to get going. Uh, you know, we're working really hard and we hope everybody comes out to, to watch us play, but uh, we're going to give them something to see.